Hey, what's good, y'all? Welcome back to another reaction video with your boy, Money Commando. Today, we got another Aussie video. We got TikToker humiliates himself calling others poor. Let's get into it. This TikToker just humiliated himself by screaming at another streamer to leave because he was, in quote, poor. You know, Crazy, because that bro. is a normal and reasonable way to act. Influencers gonna influence, I guess. Or they're just under the influence, which he had to have been. But this whole story revolves around Bryce Hall, who's the big cool guy calling people poor. Or the influencer under the influence. Bro, didn't you get, didn't he get like beat up, beat up by Austin McBroom? Why is he doing this? We have Mizkiff over here, who's the guy being called poor. And then wow. finally, Tfue, who documented all of this in his vlog titled, I'm Quitting YouTube, which is an odd title for a video showing all this. But hey, TLDR, he announces that he's going to post more on X, formerly known as Twitter. And then he goes gambling in Las Vegas, where all of this unfolds. We can watch that video together, but Mizkiff just uploaded a reaction to this video where he adds more context. So now we're reacting to a reaction. I guess you can call that reaction squared or... Video wait, cute. so hang on, wait. We just want to react to our reaction, to his reaction. Well, let's get into it. All right, let's watch this. Let's get out of here. Wow. I, I have $500. Oh, wow. You have a lot of money. Get out of here. Wow. Oh, no, I, no. All right, let's lay down what happened. So I told you guys about someone trying to pick a fight with me, and I didn't want to say what it was because it was so stupid first of all this guy looks like my uncle this guy and i literally probably bonded i don't know who he is but we bonded more than anyone else that entire night bryce <laughs> hall it, let, let's just watch it's so stupid wow you have a lot of money increase your bank account you loser <laughs> what a high iq insult number one who says that to begin with but also is dumb enough to say that in a room filled with influencers filming this whole alter what if you could yeah, do SEO? That's some goofball. Bryce Hall, bro. What makes you think you the sh Like, what makes him think he's the shit, bro? Like, for real, bro. Did he get knocked out by Austin and Broom, like I said, bro? Seeing this footage from a hidden camera. No, Bryce Hall is saying all this with a big old Sony A7 Mark III shoved in his face. I can't hear it. He's good. I'm, 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 I'm not kidding. Dude, no, he's so. no, he's no, no, you're not. Bryce, shut the what yeah. customer do you guys? No, you're not. I'll give you some tips. Here's what happened. Let me sh let me just show what happened with Bryce Hall. Crazy, and this is what's bro. so dumb about this whole thing. I'm sitting there with Tifu, and basically I'll tell I'll tell everything. I don't care. Bryce Hall was basically acting really f mean to the lady. He was. He was acting ridiculously mean. He was like, like getting super pissed at her and like it, you know how like you troll with like the lady that's like sitting there he's like oh like like uh you know how yeah, you're like oh god really, damn it come on you can't give me a like, better hand really made him do this though bro at the end of the day he's trolling money right you know what i'm saying he using his money and y'all just gonna lose if you win you win you lose you lose what makes him do this bro and, well he was like you like god damn it like Crazy, what the like you this is such he was like kind of yelling at her right and i say to her i'm like he's just joking wow so then i said that and bryce hall looks at me points at me and demands for me to get out of the entire lobby of Crazy, this place bro. because he said that what i was doing was insane he runs this shit. i'm a broke bitch that can't afford any of this stuff and he basically screamed and yelled and about- I'm gonna lie, call him Miskin Broke is insane. That nigga got some bread. He's like one of the biggest streamers on Twitch, I believe. 100 people insane, came around bro. us to watch Bryce scream right. at me the entire time for like right. 15 minutes. Man, we need the full footage. This is some right. S-tier level clownery. It's always the people with zero personality that have money to act like this as well. Because you have to have zero personality to stoop to this level. Because being drunk is not an excuse to call someone a brokey over and over again and want them to leave because of that. Really? Is your ego that sensitive? Then he starts screaming. I don't know if it's in this. He starts screaming saying he's going to kick my ass and you can Crazy, see the veins bro. popping out in his neck as he's <laughs> yelling at me saying that he's gonna beat the shit out of me Crazy, and bro. That he can bro, one biscuit, bro i don't know why i keep crying bro i don't know what the fuck going on but miss gift bro you shouldn't have teed the fuck up and man like i'm gonna beat your ass bro like because he cannot be doing that to you man you a streamer bro the nigga does tiktok he ain't as lit as you twin He's not. Simple. Bro. Shot me. And I'm just like, what the f 
just happened. We all were sitting there. XQC was sitting there. Like Whoa. we were all so confused on what the hell was going on. I, I have five hundred dollars. Oh wow! <laughs> so I was trolling when he was on me, obviously, because I knew this was so <laughs> stupid. What? How did he expect this to end? Everyone around him is telling him to stop. But he won't. I guess all he does now is box, so he might have an early onset of CTE if he thinks acting like this Crazy, is a good bro. idea. You say I got... Do you understand how, how much better it is that he's saying all this stuff and I'm going with it and I it's all wrong? And that he looks like the dumbest idiot because all these people know that I'm that that's not true. I feel like yeah, he's still. Everybody know he got some money, bro. Like that was some dumbass shit. Compensating bro. for the fact that he lost to Austin McBroom. Yeah, that's bro. what I said, bro. I just said that. No, this guy's never seen the battle. <laughs> <laughs> How are you gonna talk? Well, I'm playing money that you've never seen in your life. You could only imagine gambling $50,000. Wow, Bryce, you're so cool, man. This dude has like zero situational awareness as everyone around him is essentially telling him to shut up. Well, these are definitely man, some funny money, sound bro. bites. $50,000 in a year. He makes it in a month. That's not true. Hey, relax. I'll take care of it. I'm going to ask you to get up from the game. So they get me out of there, Crazy, which is bro. insanity. Wait, even you didn't even do anything. XQC, who's up here on the top left, is like, why the f*** is Miz being kicked out? And Bryce Hall just got so mad. The entire audience is just staring at me. This guy who is friends with Bryce is just like, I'm sorry, dude. Like, he felt so bad. And Tifu was laughing the entire time because Tifu knew I was just trolling. Yeah, Crazy. I mean, casinos be like that because if Bryce is sitting there losing tens of thousands of dollars and Ms. Kiff is sitting there with $500, they're going to want Bryce sitting at the table for a lot longer. So yeah, they're, they're going to he got more money. try to accommodate that to Bryce sense. as much as possible because they want him to lose more money. Is that right, though? No, but casinos go burr. They don't care. They want that money. So I leave with my Corona that I got for free. Obviously, I don't have the money to play on this table. This table is crazy. This is also the guy who's famous for doing TikTok dances and thirst traps. Sorry, Brokey. He not wrong, though. That's what I'm saying, bro. Misgift streams, bro. This nigga got, like, bread. What the fuck this nigga on? That's why I had to mute, because I think it's copyright. Cut that shit out, I see, bro. Turn that weak ass shit off. To two days. I wish you put more in Tifu because this thing was funny as he screamed at me for like 15 minutes straight, and you could see his veins popping out yelling at me. I didn't. So I just trolled more. I'm like, you're right. I can't afford it. I'm Tifu's cameraman. Let me stay. So then XQC starts talking to this lady who's kind of in charge of this whole thing, and it's like this guy literally didn't do anything. Bryce Hall just basically freaked out at him for no reason um and i'm just sitting there yeah. like what the hell's going on Bri bot shit on. no cap hey, look do i think bryce hall could bot probably shit. kick my ass i'd hope so he's a fighter so i'm like i don't want to do this this is the dumbest in the world uh and he was so pissed well that was one of the most avoidable influencer situations i've seen in a while it's safe to say that we witnessed some tiktok clout rage today and some brain rot who knows? A little bit of both. But either way, influencers doing oopsies like this, they do not come without apologies. No. <laughs> I to apologize. Like, I lost a lot of money. It's fine. Okay. No, no, no. We're good. Really deal, bro. Dang. One in chat if he did this because he found out who I was. <laughs> Look at his face. He doesn't even mean it. Obviously not, dude. He probably realized. Here's what I'm thinking. He probably realized that I have clout, and he probably realized that Tifu was recording this whole thing, so he probably said to himself, I probably should probably make up with them because probably, probably, probably. Or all of his yeah. boys got onto him. So that, his boys probably was on his nigga. Ass. That was his apology there. Uh, I wouldn't really say that was a great apology. It just seemed very insincere. It seems like he was doing that because he felt like he had to, or that people around him were telling him to, hey, you got to go apologize. And he's like, I don't want to apologize, but I guess I'll go do it. That's kind of what it felt like. It that felt was like months that, ago, apparently. Sure. Now the situation went viral again because Tfue posted that vlog. So now he went to Twitter to post another apology that says, I have to address this. I was down about $40,000 in two hours gambling, already in a bad mood. I had no idea who that guy was and he was needling me at the blackjack table while I was losing. See, I that's why you shouldn't call another man broke. You know what I'm saying? 
You never know who that person is, bro. Don't call another man. Had a bro. few drinks in my system and lack of sleep. I apologized immediately, and after I cooled down, I realized I sounded like a total peenie. That was my sensor right there. I'm human and I have emotions, and I realized I acted irrationally. Ms. Kiff, I'm sorry, and your next blackjack buy-in is on me. Nothing you said here justifies acting like this. Grow up and humble yourself, as it seems like the TikTok clout has gotten you a little bit too high up on that no high shame, horse. Bro. It's kind of a shame that a full clip of the situation wasn't posted because Be more humble. context is always better but hey at least he only lost forty thousand dollars to a casino and he didn't steal forty thousand dollars from a church and blow it on candy crush like this priest did because that is just an absolutely insane story yeah, that you lie, that wasn't the same video but y'all boys like comment and subscribe and yeah i'm gonna see you guys in the next reaction video